Hi everyone, welcome to new videos on question solving uh, videos for MRCS. A uh, 45 years old lady is undergoing a Whipple's procedure for carcinoma of the pancreatic head. The bile duct is transected. Which of the following vessels is mainly responsible for blood supply of the bile duct remnant? So here we can see a 45 years old lady is undergoing a Whipple's procedure for carcinoma of the pancreatic head. The bile duct is transected. Which of the following vessels is mainly responsible for the blood supply of the bile duct? So here we have to find out the blood supply of the bile duct first. Then it is will be very easy for us uh, to the uh, blood supply of the bile duct remnant. So we have the options. Options are cystic artery, hepatic artery, portal vein, left gastric artery, and none of the above. And now we have to find out the artery which supplies the common bile duct or bile duct, then the remnant of the bile duct. So here we can see these are the structure. Uh, it is the uh, gallbladder. Then here is the cystic duct, and cystic duct uh, binds to it. Uh, together with common hepatic duct they form the common bile duct or bile duct so here we can see the bile duct or common bile duct it lies in this area and here the right hepatic duct and left hepatic duct they form common hepatic duct common hepatic duct and cystic duct they form the common bile duct or bile duct during the Whipple's procedure, all the structures are cut or, and part of the uh, bile duct is transected. In the second picture, here we can see this is the common hepatic duct, this is cystic duct, and they form the common bile duct or bile duct, and it goes and finally open in the uh, second part of the duodenum. So during Whipple procedure, this structure is cut. So we have to find out this common bile duct. It gets blood supply. We can see here uh, it gets blood supply from this artery. And this artery, if we go upward, we can see it arises from this artery. And, and this is the common hepatic artery or hepatic artery. And it is the right hepatic artery. So they arises from the hepatic artery. In the second picture, we also see it is the common bile duct and this common bile duct gets blood supply which arises from these vessels these vessels and these vessels is common hepatic artery and this is the right hepatic artery so they get blood supply from common hepatic artery and from right hepatic artery on the other hand we can see that this gets blood supply from hepatic artery so our final answer is hepatic artery the hepatic artery it supplies the blood supply to the bile duct and bile duct remnant and bile duct remnant present in the upper part so it is no matter uh, where it gets blood supply the all part of the uh, uh, common bile duct or bile duct get blood supply from the hepatic artery thank you very much